Hello, we're going to Portugal today. Yeah. Flying with EasyJet, they charge you 70, was it 70 pounds, 60 pounds? Something. Something ridiculous for a suitcase. So we're sharing a suitcase. We've been weighing this for a while. There's my bra. Um, <laughs> I'm not that stressed. No, you're I'm just. It's actually. We're actually hot. We're getting there. I don't know if it's good. It's good or not. <laughs> um, I think we're there. Quick update. We've arrived at Gatwick. The car has been parked. We're going to check in and go to the airport. Yay! We made it on the bus. She's in the back. The back. Yeah, she's. We just got on the bus with no driver. Never yeah. mind. <laughs> We've literally just done this all ourselves. We've put the tag on. And now, bye bag, bye bye. Oh, 22.2. Yes. We did it somehow. <laughs> so we're at Jamie's Italian because it has great gluten free options. Nettie's meal. This looks amazing. Non, non gluten free. Non gluten free. This was basically the only thing I could have because they have nothing on the gluten free menu because they're in the administration. This. <laughs> How does that make you feel? <laughs> Nettie nearly cried in there. Boy. I could cry right now. I'm just thinking about it. I don't even look at it. It's time to go. Are we boarding? Yeah. Oh, let's go. Oh. England men's first team are playing the Nations League final. We have a bag. We are here in Portugal. And we're going to meet our taxi driver, Pedro Pereira, who will have a sign with Letty's name on. I'm really excited about it. You're so important. Well, yeah. And fancy, I and I love it. The Nations League welcome desk. <laughs> We can't open the door. <laughs> we have arrived. I think the last thing I filmed was us not being able to get into the apartment. Um, we then Nettie phoned the people and there was a bit of a language barrier, slightly. So then she was going to drive here and it would have taken 50 minutes. But then she called back and told us to knock on next door. So this man can help us in. The door's a bit sticky. The door's a problem. bit sticky. He did it straight away. Nettie is now door pro. I cannot do it. Best part was this man's cat came to say hello. So and cute. She was so lovely. So he said she likes visiting the neighbours. So that was good. Some sparkling wine. Didn't know it was sparkling. That's fine. Cider. Cider. Some Pineapple. Twix. Twix. I've got pom bear and dairy milk. And that's a gourmet dinner thing. And also we just watched the end of that match. So, Portugal. <laughs> That's it, just yeah. Portugal. Portugal in the final. Uh, okay, see you tomorrow when I'm less delirious. <laughs> I have had such a good sleep and such a good relax this morning. It's like 10 to 12 and we've not really done a whole lot yet. I've managed to sort my face out and my hair. I'm not dressed yet. This is not a cute little apartment. It's so adorable. Nettie brought her nasty stick, so. We're watching the good place. Our view is also incredible. Hi, Porto. It's very windy today and it's gonna rain. So great.
them. Now I have to scan our QR codes at gate seven. We've had a traumatic day, haven't we? It's very traumatic. <laughs> we'll oh. talk about it later. Oh yeah. But I did have curly hair when the day began. To put it up. Well, I was wearing makeup. <laughs> you still look lovely though. Thanks, darling. Ooh, official fan shop. Selling overpriced for crap, but I will definitely buy it. <laughs> Me. What do you lose? Men keep trying to talk to us. Men need to stop. Men need to stop trying to talk to us. boiling water on the hob because the kettle doesn't work. Yay Porto! The weather is so much better today. I'm so angry about it. It's really freaking irritating. But I'm happy that we get to go out in it. Um, oh yeah, so yesterday the last thing I filmed was us celebrating Jesse's goal. We're 2-1 up. Um, oh, I did film the screen when it suddenly popped up. What did it say? It said VAR. VAR goal check. Goal check. And I went, Netty, what the fuck? And then yep. we were like, what? And then all of a sudden, the goal didn't count, but then everything fell apart. It did. And then it went to extra time, and it was cold, and it was dark, and then we lost. And then we had to go to the cabin and get your phone charger. Yes, they confiscated my phone charger, which is the stupidest thing, and they had no system in this no stupid system. cabin. They were just saying to people, you were giving your ticket over and people were just going what? Describe your item! Describe your item. Some woman nearly lost their camera. Then we had to stand in the rain waiting for a train for over an hour. It was all very traumatic. Once we went to the station, it was just a case of go get on the train oh, yeah. and then we went about 10 minutes off. And we didn't even get a McDonald's. We had Pom Bears and snack bars for dinner and wine and cider. <laughs> but today, we're forgetting about that. And we're forgetting about the fact we have to go back to Gimaresh and have a third place playoff. <laughs> Not for two days. Who cares? We're gonna go out into this lovely weather and Tourist. see some of Porto and eat some food and do some photo shoots. Tourist. It's gonna be great. We've got the fish cake that I've been so excited about. Thank you for letting us come and have the fish cake. That's absolutely fine. There's a lot of pressure on this. How is it? Good. Am I gonna like it or am I gonna hate it? I think you'll like it. Okay. It's mostly potato at this stage, but I think you'll like it. Okay. Oh yeah. That was worth the wait. It is very salty, you're right. Good. We've got more food. We've got these gluten-free wraps from Hand Go Takeaway. Mm -hmm. I have a heart here, but it's tuna and cheese and lettuce and tomato and like a bunch of salt and pepper that she put in. And then she got a nice turkey one. Turkey, all the same but turkey as a tuna. They're really good. Really good. And we're just wandering with our wraps in Porto. There's the Porto sign. Yay! We're gonna go do a photo shoot. We just navigated here by ourselves, no maps. I'm impressed. Come in. We are basically explorers now. We are. Oh, it's we green. We could go anywhere. So cute. Oh, beautiful. And then you see all the portals. <laughs> 
Gimmerish today. Thanks, England. Love you. I'm mad about it. How do you feel? Pretty fantastic. That's a so lie. Can you tell? Ah, <laughs> uh, let's go get the train. I've maybe never been happier than I am right now. <laughs> Look at this. Ah. I just had to down that wine. <laughs> It was a mistake. It was funny, I enjoyed it. You know, so was the third please player. Oh. The whole day's a mistake. Let's start in T News. Dun, dun, dun. This is better than Thursday, right? I'm more confident about this than I was on Thursday. Yay! Mm. <laughs> so this is somehow how close we've been. Number 17. But all I can think is imagine if we were this close for the final.
victory lap, lads. Victory. His head's fucking massive. Ready to go, that's well, a lie. We don't want to go. I'm gonna miss this view so much. Oh, Porter, you've been lovely. England, you were lovely in the end. In the end. Look at my new shirt. Woo! I'm a football fan now, me. You were always a football fan, well. How do you feel about, well, was I? <laughs> that's true. How do you feel about going home? Really sad. Just don't wanna go. I wanna stay here. I don't wanna drink all of this. No. But I do want to stay here and I don't want to go to work. Yeah. I don't think I showed this yet. We wrote Survived Yamarash 2019. Because we did. We did. And it was survival. Bye. Gluten free options at the airport. <laughs> Excellent work. Your burger looks amazing. Hopefully it will be. Mm -hmm. Look, these are little footballs. Look at them. This is maybe the saddest time I've ever had coming home. <laughs> we just want to be in Porto singing about Harry Maguire and his massive head. 